R&B money. First big record. <laughs> to me, Love Be Like. Hmm. It's from SoundCloud, and that was what made me drop out of school. Because it got 100,000 plays in a day. I'm out this bitch. I'm, I'm out. out. <laughs> I'm gone. Mm, mm. I know I was here. I said, <laughs> not no more. Not no more, I'm out. 100, Communications 000. 101. <laughs> 100,000. I'm out. Drop out. <laughs> I was coming here for this. I got it. I'm out. <laughs> I was coming here for Y'all ain't even give me a scholarship. Man, what? Yeah, yeah. Peace. Yeah. Peace. <laughs> you said with, peace? With a, peace. <laughs> with a T. Whoa. Yeah. Like Tyson. Peace. I'm going to add that to my repertoire. Are you kidding me? A hundred thousand in one day? That's all. that To me, I was like, I'm famous. Yeah. That's what I told myself. Yeah. And then when Girls That Dance came out, I said, oh. It's over. I'm it. Yeah. Well, give me the plaque. But I knew at that time <laughs> that I'm missing something to get this plaque because why ain't it here yet? Right. <laughs> but we'll, we'll be all right. right. But yeah, no. Between Love Be Like and Girls That Dance, like those are the ones where I was like, okay, this is what fame is. Mm -hmm. And then when I started to see it can just keep getting redefined. Um, and th th I've been trying to do this for like months now. I'm trying to like find a way to compare the music industry to sports. I'm like, is it basketball? Is it football? Just so I can gauge the wins a little bit better. Cause it's so nuanced. And did we win? Is this, is this the plaque that says we got the ring? Are these your rings? Or is this like a, a trophy? Is this the MVP award? And so I, I tried mm -hmm. to do that. And I felt like if I had a metric that I wanted to hit and I hit it, that's the ring. And so Love Be Like was the first one. Mm -hmm. I was like, 100K, like, that's it. And then it just kept increasing and increasing. Yeah. yeah so, I mean, it's, it's multiple yeah. championships. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. But the difference is in music, you're truly competing with yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Truly. Like, we can say, oh, well, the Grammy and the, you know, I won this award at the end of the year. And I guess that would probably be perceived to be what our... Super Bowl is and our, mm -hmm. you know, NBA championship. But the truth of the matter is that you're you're really competing with yourself of yeah. where you feel that, you know, that success lies. Like you said, for you to see that hundred thousand, that's your Super Bowl. Yeah. yeah that yeah. was life changing for yeah. you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I think with music, we put too much on, you know, everybody else's things. Yeah. You know, instead of just being like, this is what satisfies me. Mm -hmm. This is what I believe mm -hmm. is the greatest shit in the world. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like that, you even having having that story and explaining that, like, yo, when you saw that 100,000, because we can have so many yeah. of those moments in the music business yeah. that in, you know, like in the NBA, you just met, you can make it to the league. And then you try to get your contract and then you try to, and then you, but in, in music every day, you can be satisfied by... That song you just wrote. Yeah. Or this room being like, nigga, that's the one. There's satisfaction in that that we have in music that we that I don't I don't think mm. I personally that I don't think that you know other forms have. Mm. That that it, that instant gratification. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, you know, I know how I feel to dunk. I dunked the basketball. It's Talk cool. About it. Talk about it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Talk about but, it. But you know, seeing a record go the way that they go and, and then seeing people react to it the same, you know what I mean, or even crazier. Like, I've never, I always say this, I've never seen a woman throw their panties at somebody for dunking a basketball. She might have thrown her panties about the contract he signed. Mm, talk about it. But panty I've talk. seen panties get thrown off of a, ooh, yeah. Come on, we having come panty on. talk, okay? We're going to always have panty talk. Okay. 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 We're going to always have panty talk. This is the R&B <laughs> Money Podcast. Come on, bro. This is a little tough. Come, come on, bro. Get out of the jacket. Come You've been on, lifted. Brother. Come out the jacket. Yeah. Come on. We having yeah. panty talk. Yeah. We having panty talk. Hold this. Get that out of here. Because the panty talk. Give it to him. The other thing about music, too, though, is that we can get it all broke. Okay. We can get it all broke. I understand. Talk about it. You know what I mean? We can, we can dive into that. Yeah. You know what I mean? When it's like, oh, damn, you date him? That's cool. I probably can't afford to go to the game he's playing in. But you like this song I wrote, don't you? Yeah, absolutely. Because at the end of the day. Talk about it. Come on. It all comes down to the yams. Y'all good at what y'all do. We... This is a good show. It's R&B. 
I don't just, care how you cut it. You know what I mean? I don't care how you slice it. Still a yam. Still a yam, man. Still a yam. You yeah. Fre- you freshly braided. <laughs> I know her too. I know why. <laughs> Yeah. Just in case that yam is looking. Yeah. <laughs> Just in mm-hmm. case. <laughs> it's the playoffs right now, ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> you said you freshly break. Yeah, yeah. We know why. It's always the playoffs for us. Always the playoffs. <laughs> always. Is in being in competition with yourself, it's just it's just the progressions that make it all make sense. Mm-hmm. It's getting a hundred more people in the building. Yeah. It's getting a hundred more spins that week. It's, you know, I I don't I mean I like the award I love the award shows. I love it. I, yeah. I I get I get what it is. But I've seen so many historians and even current artists have so much success without it. Great success. Yeah. So it goes back to what you're saying. Like yeah. it's 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 about you. It's about your progressions yeah. and your upgrades and yeah. continuing to to be better and build better and that word continuing to spread of who you are and what you do yeah. and them and them venues getting bigger and bigger. You know what like, I'm saying? Like I don't and, know you through the numbers. Yeah, yeah. I know you I, through the woman. Have you heard to thou? <laughs> yes, I have. Mm. Yeah. I like that record. This man is dropping Let's bars play. today. Yeah. Like, but seriously though, and that mm-hmm. that is something that um that you've established mm-hmm. within your artistry and your career. That's special. You said it earlier. You were like, you know, I I knew women were supporting me. Yep. You yeah. know what I mean? And that 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 you 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 had your target audience. Mm-hmm. You stuck to it, and they 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 become your introduction. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I mean? It was it wasn't like you know the radio introduced me to you or some playlist or that it literally the woman it was just he's dope he's dope if you heard him that's simple yeah and then it became if you didn't hear him nigga what you all you You don't know about that no panties for you (laughs) yeah (laughs) oh man like you've done hey bro listen you got done some fly shit bro really appreciate that some fly shit really shout out women man shout out women (sighs) talk to talk yeah (laughs) R&B money!